Satvik, today also your camera is not working. Satvik, okay. Vivek. Huh? You see, if I tell, then you'll just on. Huh? What kind of? Okay, see you, children, all of you. From a solid cylinder, solid circular cylinder with height 10 centimeter and radius of base 6 centimeter, a right circular cone of same height and same base are removed. Find the volume of the remaining solid. Find the volume of the remaining solid. From a solid right circular cylinder with height 10 centimeter and radius of the base 6 centimeter, a right circular cone of same height and same base are removed. Find the volume of remaining solid. So here cone and cylinder is there. You know everything about cone and cylinder? Those who doesn't know about the formula, please let me know. All of it solve Satvik. And then Anyone find the answer? They can write in the chat box, children, those who are finding the answers. And those who are not getting, please try to understand here. From a right circular, from a solid right circular cylinder with height 10 centimeter. So just make one cylinder over here. And radius of this much base, a right circular cone of the same height and same base are removed. Same height and same base it means one cone we should remove from there. I mean, this part, this blue part, we should remove. See, this blue part is there. No, we have to remove from this. Okay, so I'm just writing in two parts. See, once so I'm writing cylinder, and here I'm writing cone. Okay, so cone height is 10 centimeter, radius is 6 centimeter, and cone, cone height is same 10 centimeter only. Radius is 6 centimeter. There's no change between radius and radius and height of the cone and cylinder. Okay. See so both are same. Now find the volume of remaining solid. The volume of remaining solid is what we can write. Volume of cylinder minus volume of cone. Is it clear, children? What I've written here? Volume cylinder minus volume of cone. Here, height and radius both are same. Now, see, volume of cylinder is pi r square h minus 1 by 3 pi r square h. Remember here, everything, r, h, everything is same here and here also same. Because radius and height are same for cone as well as cylinder. Then we can take it common. Okay, if everything is same. If it is not same, then we have to think over it. So what we can get here, children? 2 by pi, 3 pi r square h. 2 by 3 pi r square h. So we can write it down as 2 by 3, 22 by 7, 
radius is 6 into 6 and height is 10. So 3 to the 6. So what we get the answer here? 3, uh, 5 to 8, 0 by 7. 5 to 8, 0 divided by 7. If you divide it, you will get 754 and then 2 by 7. So this is the answer. Everyone got the answer, children? Anyone who is dif getting different answer from this? I got the answer, sir. It's the same answer. Okay. Now, next question is question number two. Another question. From a foreign cylinder whose height is this. Conical cavity. Hmm. Tell me cylinder here, solid cylinder whose height is this, conical cavity, 8 cm base 6 cm is followed out. Find the volume and total surface area of the remaining solid. So I am just uh, pasting the diagram over here, how it looks like the cylinder part. Okay. So all of you just try to see the cylinder. This is your cylinder and uh, your cone. This is going to take it out from this, right? So what I'll write here, I just once I write cylinder and here I'll write cone because we have to write volume and total surface area. So first of you children, here you can't take common and all of radius and height is different. So you can't take common simply. So what is the cylinder height and all? Height is 16 centimeter, radius is 12 centimeter. What about cone? Cone height is 8 centimeter, radius is 6 centimeter. Okay. So we have to find volume and total surface area of the remaining solid. So, how to find volume of the remaining solid? So, volume of remaining solid. How to find Satvik? Satvik, volume of remaining solid, how to find? Sir, like which, uh, which one, sir? This figure you understood what I discussed right now. There, yes, sir. In this cylinder, we have to take out this cavity part. This conical part we have to take out and throw. Means this part yeah, we have to minus to... it. So what I should write here? Volume of cylinder minus volume of cylinder minus what I should do? Tell me, Satvik. Minus the volume. volume of cylinder minus volume of uh, cone. Yes. So what is the volume of cylinder formula, Satvik? You have to see now formula and all. Huh? No, sir. Then tell me the formula first. Means from three days I'm teaching this. Before also I taught. Well, you are not revising at all. Sir, I didn't revise. 
Why? Someone told you don't touch the notebook. Sir, no, sir. Next time I don't want to listen the same word. I didn't revise. Okay, sir. Silithwick? Yes, sir. What is the volume of cylinder? 1 by 3 pi r square h. Volume when, of cylinder? Uh, pi r so square h is volume of cylinder and 1 by 3 pi r square, uh, square h is cone. Okay. Now here we are writing here R1, H1 we should write because children, why we are writing R1, H1, R2, H2? Because these both are different, different for this. Okay. That's why we have to write in this way. Here you can take only pi as common. Pi as common. And uh, in bracket you can write here R1 square H1 minus 1 by 3 R2 square H2. Okay. So pi is 22 by 7 in bracket r1 square so r1 is 12 into 12 into 16 minus 1 by 3 r2 is 6 into 6 into 8 okay so 3 twos are 6 now 22 by 7 uh, we can take common again children here 6 twos are 12 right and here also 12 we can take it common then we can write here uh, 12 into and one more thing we can take common if you want. You can solve directly also, but I'm trying to take, take 8 common. Yes, we can take 8 common also. So see 12 and 8 we have taken common. So from here we have taken 8 common. It means what we can, what will be painting here? 12 into 2, right? Minus 2, 6 and here 8 is already common. The so minus nothing is pending. So you should write here minus 1. Is it clear, children, what I have written here? Yes, sir. So 22 by 7 into 12 into 8 into 23. Okay. Now 7 will not go. Now you have to solve. So 22 into... <laughs> Just multiply and get the answer, children. 22 into 12 into 8. 12 is done. Huh? 6939. 6939 divided by 7? No, sir. By dividing with 7, I got 6939, sir. After dividing, it's going to completely divide it? Or how is it? No, sir. After that, 4, 3, sir. 0.43. Okay, six nine three nine point four three. Four three, yes, sir. Four three centimeter cube. Okay, everyone get the same answer, children. Sir, two minutes. Huh? What? This is the first answer. Means you mean to say volume of this. Now total surface area. Now total surface area formula of total surface area, how can find total surface area of here you have to think so much, okay? Remaining solid. Miss, which part we can touch? That is more important here, right children? I think I got it. What is the answer plus there for this? Uh, the total surface area of cylinder minus the surface area of the circle of the hole plus the CSA of hole. See what I'm saying that uh, means that the same thing you are thinking or not just tell me. Okay. See first of all what I'm just uh, trying to paint try to understand here. So I'm dividing into three parts, okay? So first is I'm just dividing into so CSA of cylinder. First case I'm writing as CSA of cylinder. 
then area of this second part is area of circle this circle then third one i'm just discussing about this concentric circle okay this concentric circle area of this concentric circle fourth and last part i'm discussing is your csa of cylinder sorry csa of this cone try to understand here all of you and this part is not included okay because that is whole no we are taking out right is it clear children what i have written in four colors yes sir first i have taken csa of cylinder csa of cylinder then this one is area of circle area of circle then this one this one is csa of cone and this is area of concentric circles understood children concentric yes sir circle so we are divided into four parts once again i am repeating this blue part one what you are just seeing over here that is csa of cylinder then this pink color that is your area of circle green color is the csa of the cone and fourth is your area of concentric circles children this four part is clear to everyone or having doubts plus the same thing you are thinking of plus the same thing you are thinking before or any changes is there i was subtracting instead of adding all of them okay okay anyway you can find tsa also again you have to subtract this part this part you have to subtract right plus the that yes. only you might have done okay yes that also you can do we can just take complete this whole part complete part you can take and you have to remove this middle one again right yes anyone still having doubt dipshika sir so in that diagram is it uh, the cone is having is it, is it an indent in the cylinder are they taking the shape of a cone out of it uh, see uh, uh, sairithvik this cone is there no that you are throwing out of it okay if, sir if you are throwing out of it you are you get one slant inside the deep thing you get in the cylinder can you imagine that understood sir that deep part only i have mentioned with your green color all right okay sir sir so Ma the second circle layer is the base of the cone right the one that is not yellow yeah that is the pink one you are saying right that red no, color no sir i'm saying uh, the yellow sir, the ye yellow ring is rare around uh, that one circle is there right yeah that part is not there no that is not part of it because that is the base of the cone right which, which we have taken out yeah exactly yes okay sir understood got the question uh so now here i'm writing all the things now csa of remaining solid is csa of one minute i'll write here csa of cylinder plus csa of cone plus area of circle means this bigger circle right and pl plus area of what concentric circle concentric circle or you can do if you want children tsa of cylinder tsa of cylinder minus area of a small circle you know area of a small circle area of a base area of base of one minute one minute. again i'll write here area of base of which one cone plus csa of cone you can use anything csa of cone see that's clear or not this is three parts this is having three parts csa of cylinder area of the base that is cone base and plus csa of cone okay right children and here it's having four part plus there now i think second one you are just uh, thinking of right second one only you are doing right yes both the question both the solution is clear to everyone children both part what i have written here yes sir so this and this okay 
so next one uh, i just see one 16 is the height of cylinder and it is the height of cone 12 okay fine now i'm just using the second formula only i'm just writing here tsa of cylinder that is 2 pi r and r plus h minus area of the base of the cone that is pi r square r1 r2 i'm writing here this i'm just thinking cylinder as r1 cylinder is r1 h1 r1 r1 h1 cone we are writing r2 plus csa of cone that is pi r l pi r l the cone is your uh, r2 over here the so pi r2 into l so what i can write here uh, pi only you can take or directly put the values if you want okay so 2 into 22 by 7 radius of the cylinder is 12 again 12 and height is 16 right is it clear minus 22 by 7 into what is the radius of the base of cone cone i think is 6 no cone radius is 6 yes so 6 into 6 plus 22 by 7 uh, radius that is how much radius is 6 uh, cone only right 6 6 into 6 into 8 6 into 6 into 8 is it clear now so three parts you can solve and get the answer so this is the first part second part here and third part so 2 into 22 into 12 uh, 16 to the 32 3 16 3 19 divided by 7 you can't cancel also no uh, what we do no we just what we do 22 by 7 we take it out only that's better i think correct then we can do something if we that is more easier i think so 22 by 7 and again if you want to take uh, anything you can take common children here is 36 and 36 you can't take common no uh, 12 only you take common 12 you can't take you can take but leave no problem 6 you can take from here 6 you can take from here 6 you can take from here right so into 6 you take in list, last what will come 2 into here you have taken 6 so we can write again 2 in bracket 12 into 16 minus 6 plus 6 into 8 48 again 22 by 7 into 6 2 2 is a 4 48 into 16 8 6 are 48 24 28 48 7 6 8 7 68 plus 42 so 22 by 7 into 6 into 8 2 10 6 4 10 1 11 8 so now what is the answer come just check once We are getting the same thing or different calculator I'm using now 22 into 7 22 into 6 into 8 10 divide by 7 1 5 2 7 4 1 5 2 7 4 point 2 8 this is coming let me check once so here what is coming one minute two 
2939 is coming here. Uh -huh. It's not coming. Acha. We are finding here. Pi R L we are to not using here. Right. So 2187. Something is wrong. Shall let's check. Anywhere we are doing mistake. Because TSA of con is 2 pi R into R plus H. So L we have not find. Right. L. This L we have not find. What is L? L 10 we should write. No. L we should write 10. So here we can write it as 6 is taken common, 22 by 7 common. So 60 we have to write here. So 60 minus 6 is 54. Let me check once. Something is not wrong no, here. Pi R square we remove from there. Again, pi R L we are using. So 2 into 22 by 7 into 12 into 16. PSA or CSA? Pi R 22, 6 into 10. Here is, see, here we have done it. Sir. Yeah. So we have multiplied 2 into 16. We have to add 2 into yes. 16. Yes, here you should add. So 12 plus 16. Yeah, correct. So here we have to write. Again, I'll just do this part. That's better, better. One mistake now. So we can write uh, 22 into 22 by 7. We have taken common over here. 22 into 6 we have taken common. I'll just rephrase this part also. So 2 into 22, 22 and here we have taken 6 common. So what we can write here? 2 into here also 2 only we can write. In bracket what we can write? 6 to 8, 28 minus 6. Plus 22 by 7 is already out. 6 is only 10 we can write. Correct? Clear children? So we can write it as 22 by 7 into 6. 20 feet 56. 56 to uh, 5 to are 10. 1, 1, 2. 1, 1, 2 plus 4. 22 by 7 into 6 into 1, 1, 6. So what do we get here? 22 into 6 into 116 divided by 7. So 2187, 2187.42. All of you are getting the same answer, check children. Is it clear to everyone? Anywhere have it, having doubt any place? Now it's clear. Now answer is correct. No doubt, sir. Okay.
So second part is now total surface area we found and volume also we found, right? Anyone having doubt? No, no. No, sir. So next question is question number third one. So this question is also very, very. Means you should think only all the time about this question. See, a circus tent of cylind uh, it's cylindrical to a height of four meter and conical above it. Try to just draw the diagram first, all of you. The conical above it, I don't understand. Achha. Conical above means cylinder, you know, no? The circus tent you have seen, right? So conical is above the cylinder. I just draw the diagram once. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. I got it, sir. Uh -huh. So conical just like circus tent you have seen, right? The conical will be so for making the height of the cylinder. So children are just pasting the diagram, same thing over here. Just try to understand if you're not understanding this. See, this is a figure like this. Sir, I understood all the questions, but I didn't understand how to implement the width. What is the width for? Width, width of what? Sir, it's given the last uh, rupees 15 per meter if the width is 1.5. Acha, cost of canvas. See, ca cost of canvas is like you have seen the sari, no? Sari yes, so seen. what is the width? We're calculating the width of the, the tent. Wait, wait. If I discuss, then we'll get to know. What goes in this? I just okay, once sir. again, once again, I'll just... Okay, so a circus tent is cylindrical to a height. So cylinder right here and cone right here. The cylindrical height is how much? Four meters. Conical above it, its diameter is 105 meters. What is 105 meters? The cylindrical part, right? The cylinder is how much? What is the radius of it? 105 divided by two meters. And radius of the cones will remain the same. The R is equals to 105 divided by 2 meters. It's clear? Sairithvik? Yes, sir. A slant height is 80. So L is given 80 meters. Calculate the total area of the canvas required. See, area of the canvas required, it means that you have to find the area of what? Means total surface. CSA of cylinder plus TSA of cone. Why not TSA of cylinder? Sir, sir because they're sharing a base. Sharing a? They're sharing the, the, the circuit part. What I'm saying, you're finding uh, CSA of cylinder. CSA of cylinder is only surrounding part, right? Yes. Why? Sir. So how, why we are not finding this one? Tell me. Because CSA not sir, because that one. is a tent. It will be covered by grass. I mean, sir, yeah. the floor. The floor. Acha. What about this one? So that is the base of the cone. So we can calculate this here. That. that we can calculate? We don't so have to calculate can... that, sir, because that is the air inside the tent. Yes, yes. We, we can't feel by hand. Yes, exactly. We can't feel it, right? We can't touch. Yes, sir. So see, there is, this is a two part. So we just divide into two parts. So total surface area. So total surface area of canvas is equals to what we can write? 
टोटल सर्विस ऑफ केमिस्ट सी एस सी एस ऑफ सिलेंडर प्लस सी एस सी ऑफ कौन वेरी नाइस सो विल राइट हियर टू पाई आर एच प्लस सी एस सी ऑफ कौन पाई पाई आर एल सो सी पाई एंड आर आर इज सेम फॉर बोथ तो वी आर नॉट गोइंग टू राइट आर वन आर टू अवर हियर बिकॉज रेडियस इज सेम राइट सो पाई आर कैन टेक इट कॉमन and in bracket we can write 2h plus l okay yes, so pi 22 by 7 radius is 105 divided by 2 in bracket we can write 2 h of the cylinder remember children h is the cylinder height so cylinder height is into 4 plus l is 80 be careful when you are writing h and l don't put h all of this one cone and all it's not there but <laughs> the part of the cone okay sometimes children will do mistake here now see 2 11 7 uh, 1 is 7 7 5 is 35 so 15 into 11 the so 15 ones are 15 and 15 one 16 165 yes 14520 the whole answer 14 what sir the c uh, the whole tlc of the cone is I mean the the shape is one four five two zero. One four five two zero, right? Yes, sir. One four five two zero, very nice. So this is the meter square. We are getting the area of canvas. Now you might yes, have. Yes, sir. Canvas. Now you are having doubt that find the total cost. Find the total cost of the canvas. This you are not understanding, right? Width. What is width here, right? Correct. Anyone yes, who sir. anyone who understood this question, this second part of it, if the width is one point five, anyone Pulastya, Krishna, Bhumika, anyone of you understood why what they are saying over here, Tipshika? Yes. yes, tell me, children. Anyone of you, what is the width over here? Was one point five meter? Anyone can tell me. The diameter. Diameter of what? Pulastya. Diameter of what? Oh, diameter. Okay. Is... Oh no, that's not the diam. Uh... Yes. Tell me. Tell me. Tell me. Okay. Nobody knows, right? I'm just telling you now. Yes, sir. Now you are having a cloth, like you know. Shape over here. See. So you are using this. We don't know what is the length of this cloth. We don't know this, right? And this cloth length, what is given here? Cloth length is one point five meter. Width is one point five meter. And so, children, the how much length of cloth? How much? This is canvas. This is what? Canvas. What we are going to use to make the tent. Understood. Here, all the children try to understand very. Carefully. So, how much length is required? Means you have to find the x. That is how much. If you know the x, you can find the cost easily, right? Is it clear? If you are having the cost uh, length of the canvas, you can find the cost of the canvas easily. Correct or not, Bhumika? Yes, sir. So by what? One point five two zero by one point five. Yes, yes. Why we are doing like that? See this area. What Because we got. Healthy. What what yeah. Sir, I don't understand. Yes. So see this area. What we are getting, no children, all of you. This area is nothing but area of this canvas. Understood this concept. So we are finding length because we are we uh, we are dividing whole by width. Wait wait wait. Don't tell. But let let me finish this first. What I am saying that the area what we got here total surface area the same area with the area of this canvas. So can we write here? TSA of the what what TSA which TSA we find here TSA of canvas is equals to TSA of a hey, color is not we can not choose over ah huh? so TSA of canvas sorry TSA of what we can write here canvas or you can write TSA of 
is equal to same thing area of canvas of width one point width 1.5 meter can we write like area of canvas is 14520 is equals to x into 1.5 can we write children or not yes, yes sir. sir so x is equals to 14520 divided by 1.5 you remove this point you'll get one more zero over here now cancel this i have removed this point over now now cancel this 15 15 nines are 135 carry 10 102 so 15 six are 980 zero. Eight, zero. okay this much meters is coming now see the cost of the canvas cost of the canvas is rupees 15 per meter means one meter cost is 15 rupees so 19680 cost how much one meter cost how much rupees rupees 16 so 9680 meters cost how much rupees 16 into 9680 so we can just multiply 16 1 lakh 1 lakh so 1 lakh 54880 this much so here answer we are getting is 145200 one four uh, so we have done mistake one four five two zero by fifty one four five two zero one four five two zero nine six eight zero we are getting nine six eight zero only nine six eight zero into fifteen fifteen should come no this is not fifteen should come Krishna this is fifteen only check you, you have understood Krishna? 15 is given in the question or not? Sir. You are using calculator? Becomes, uh, one, four, five, two, zero, zero, sir. You are using calculator? No, sir. Because I written 16 into 9680 written in once, I mean, sir, immediately. So this yes, is rupees 15. Okay, fine. Sir, I didn't, uh, I didn't understand what is X in this case. Like, what do we take as X? X is the length of this canvas, Ritwik. See, X is the length of this canvas. See, X is the length of this canvas. See. Okay, so they gave us the area and we have to divide by width to get the length. They have, where they have given the area? Area we found, no, here. Yes, we found, we found, we found the area, so we have to find the length with the width. Yeah, so because this area, this area and uh, this whole canvas area is same only, no? Okay, sir. So the cost of finding just for the length. Yeah, just for the length. No, they're asking cost. No, in the question. Question is they're asking cost only. Find the total cost. See here. Yes, sir. I was confused because total cost I thought is for TSA. TSA is total surface area, not total cost. Okay, oh, sir. Sure. Anyone having doubt in any part of it? TSA of canvas. Why we are equating with this canvas, or why this uh, cost is coming into this? Satvik is not there in the meeting only, right? Next question we do now. This question. Because lengthy question is bigger. It's easy, but it's lengthy. One minute, one minute, one minute. Ah. So circus tent. Same thing is this? No, no, different, right? I just uh, give you the diag image over here for this, okay? So circus tent mm -hmm. 
circumstance is cylindrical to height of 8 meters cylindrical tent is uh, circus tent a circus tent is cylindrical to height of 8 meters surmounted by a conical part surmounted by a conical part if total height of the tent is 13 meters is given 13 meters total total height of the tent diameter of the base is 24 meters so first what we did children here <clears throat> we just write all the uh, parameters separately okay All the parameters separately will do one meter, one minute, Susan. Okay. Hello. Now see the height of the uh, total height of the uh, means, uh, tent is 13. So height of the cylinder is 8 and height of the cone is 5. Is clear or not? This what you see? Yes, sir. Height, height of the cylinder is already yes. given 8 meters. So upper part is obviously 5 meters only cone height. Correct. And here height of the tent is 13 already done. Diameter of the base is 24, so radius is 12 meters for cone as well as cylinder. We just close and just do once again. Huh. Now what we do here, we write cylinder separate here and cone here separately. So cylinder radius is how much? 12 meters. Here radius is 12 meters. Here height is, height of cylinder is 30, uh, 8 meters. What is the height of cone? 5 meters. Right here, H1, H2. Clear? Yes, sir. Next, next you write. Uh, yes, sir. L if you it required L, then you can find L if required. Okay. It's clear. Now total surface area of the tent. TSA of tent is equals to what we can write. Bhumika, tell me. TSA of tent, what we can write? The CSA of the cylinder and CSA of the cone. CSA of cylinder plus CSA of cone. Very good. Because we don't want this base, we don't want this base. So CSA part only is required. So now CSA of cylinder is 2 pi R H plus CSA of cone is pi R L. See, L is required here. So you have to find L over here. The L is root over H square plus R square. So root over 12 square plus phi square. So 144 plus 25, 169. So answer is 13 meters, clear? Now put the values now, R is same, H1 we write here. So you can take what common we can take, pi and R we can take common. And we can write 2 H1 plus L, okay? Now we can solve it easier. 2 pi, this 22 by 7 into radius, radius is 12. 2 into H1, that is 8, plus L, L is 13. 
so now we can write it here as 22 by 7 into 12 multiply by 8 twos are 16 16 plus 13 29 right now we can solve and get the answer the solve now I just use calculator whether we are getting the same answer or not. So twenty two into twelve into twenty nine divided by seven one zero nine three point seven one. 1093.71 meter square did you got the answer children anyone still having doubt in this any steps krishna you got the same answer i am checking sir sir i got the same answer got the same answer sir very good next yes, one sir, more I question is Area of canvas required to make this tent, allowing 10% of the canvas used for folding and stitching. See how much area we're getting here, no? So 10% extra you should add over here. Right. One minute, children. So 1093.71 and so 10% extra is there. So what to do for a 10% extra? 10% we can add into this, right? Yes, sir. We can add 10%. So 1093. See how to how to make it easier, children. Try to understand. Now what they have given here, uh, area of canvas. Now area of canvas we should use 10% extra user area of canvas is equals to one zero this one you have to use right and you should use 10 percent extra on this 10 percent of what 1093.71 children's 10 percent always how what will be you know that 1093.71 what will be 10 percent this point ten. this point you shift over here don't do anything what you just this point you can see no this point you can shift here only one point you shift upper you'll get the answer so what we can write here 109.371 you can add and get the answers okay children 10 percent and all is very easy 10 percent and all will be very easy what will answer you're getting just check once 1100 uh, anyone having doubt in this no, sir. So I'll use calculator 1093.71 uh, plus 109.371. One. One, 1203.08 is coming. 1203. One, this answer is not coming. 1203.081. Yeah, so total area of the canvas. Mm -hmm. Okay, one zero one two. Some answer is coming one two one five somewhere. I don't know. We'll see once again. No problem. Here, our answer is one two zero three point zero eight one. Okay, we leave till here only. You just see where, where some point mistake is coming still. We'll just check. Till here is clear to everyone, children. Is it clear how yes, we have sir. done? Okay. So we we'll close the meeting now, children. Okay, sir. Okay, sir. Okay. We'll see you on then Monday. If possible, let's just take Sunday also class, extra class. Okay. Fine, children. All of you. Thank you. Bye. Okay, sir. Bye. Thank you, sir. Bye. Thank you, sir. Bye, sir. Bye, children.